If you have your own web base, then what you can also do is embed out the diagrams.net file uh, by using HTML code. So to do that, you need to go around onto the file menu and you can go around onto the embed option where you can embed this as an image, as an SVZ, or you can generate out HTML code or iframe code right here. If you are embedding this um, in a web page, then uh, HTML is uh, a preferred option. So if I were to go around and do this, you can see that I can embed out uh, different sections and choose the zoom level right here, let it fit, or you can include a copy of the diagram, or you can create a public URL as well. So if you're using the web version, you can create a public URL as well. And I'm just going to include the copy right here. So now you can also give access to layers, tags, and like boxes. But let me just go around and then remove all of these right here and click on create. Once I do that, it creates out this code as you can see right here, this division code right here. So I can just go around and copy this right here. And I can go around over here onto a web page that I may have and enter out the code. So let's say right after uh, this section right here. So this is the header section, as you can see. And in this uh, section right here, right after the header section, uh, let me just go around over here. So I'm just going to go around, press enter and press control V to paste out that code that I generated. So once I do that, you can see that it has been inserted over here. So this is what you have. As you can see, this is the diagram and this has been inserted over here. Uh, so what you can also do is go around over here. You can see that this is the uh, division right here and you can make changes according to how you want as well. If I were to go around onto the live section, then this is what you see right here. So this is the live version as you can see right here. And now whatever you made over here is in the diagram right here. And you can even see that you got different options right here. So you can open this out and so forth. Let me just go around onto the file. So I'm using Dreamweaver to edit the HTML file right here. But let me just go around and then preview this out with, let's say, for example, Microsoft S right here and save the changes right here. So this is how you would see everything as you can see right here. So you can see that I can zoom in. This is very, very interactive. You can go around over here, fit to page, and you can go full screen over here just like this as well. So just go around over here, click on full screen, and then it opens up the viewer right here in diagrams.net itself. And this is how you can go around and embed out HTML code in your own web page as well. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.